Well, he's off to a hot start this season, but Buddy Hill's basketball journey has been a long and winding road. Sooner Sports Pad's Matt McCulloch shows us why this summer was the summer of Buddy Love. Kevin Durant, LeBron James, names synonymous with greatness. Together, they have won five of the last six MVP awards. Now, they have an even closer tie to the University of Oklahoma basketball program. After an impressive sophomore season from Sooners guard Buddy Heald, the NBA superstars took notice. Heald received invites to both Kevin Durant and LeBron James' skill academies. I got that invite, I was like, wow, you know, this is this, this a chance for me, and I just show everybody what I'm about and how serious I am. It was a fun summer of basketball for me. It's just going on out and competing against guys who's in the, in the pool in the pros, and who's in college, who's about to be pros. Not only did Heald get to showcase his talent against the nation's top players, he even got to ball up with two of the best players on the planet. Because like Vaughn had, he had so many things going on summer, so like he just wanted to play with us. It wasn't as intense than Katie. Katie he was the more intense and some of that, but I, he went up and down with us through his possessions, and uh, I, shot a sh I should have shot a ball. He was guarding me. I was going to pull it, but I didn't pull it. I'm mad at myself. I don't know why I pulled it. I didn't pull it. I, was, I wasn't scared. I just I didn't know. I, I regret it, though. Hopefully, I got an extra shot to pull it against him. Attending such prestigious camps isn't something that happens overnight. It takes hard work and dedication, being the first one in the gym and the last one to leave. That is one thing Heald has demonstrated since setting foot on campus. Yeah, but, but he's worked, always worked really hard every day to get better. And I think just naturally as a competitor, when you get invited to go play or compete against the other best players in the country, you're probably going to work a little harder yet. I really want to have great days every day, but like, that's the life of basketball, you know. You, you get to try to be great, and like only the great ones be great at the time. But like, I'm, I'm working there, and uh, I think I got a chance of being, being like a pro one these days. But I like, just working and working and working. I just got to keep on working. Heald credits his teammates for all of his accomplishments. To say thank you, Buddy parted ways with all the special gear he received at the camps. I, I give it to my teammates. Uh, just, I feel like the reason I got there, they, they got me open shots. They, they hit me in the right, right spots. They know where I'm comfortable at. And, uh, I feel like they deserve it more than I deserve it, and uh, it wouldn't look cool for me coming from, from all those camps and me just showed off my gear. There's nothing phony about Buddy. Uh, it's almost sometimes you, you think he's kind of putting someone on with his friendliness and his you know, outgoing uh, personality, but no, that's the way Buddy is. He's just got a very good knack for, again, doing things uh, that make others feel good uh, when they're around him. But the summer of Buddy Love wasn't over just yet. In August, he'll don the colors of his nation at the FIBA Centro Basket Championship. I've been playing the Bahamas national team up in Mexico, so that was a, a good experience for me. Uh, I haven't played in my country in a long time, so I was just overwhelmed. And my mom being in the same play, I was more happy because she was there too and support me. Well. A summer for the ages, a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Buddy Heald's basketball journey has taken him all across the map, but people that know him best say his journey has only just begun. Matt McCulloch, Sooner Sports Pat.